For Nancy Stanovic, golfing is a way of life. I play three days a week. I'm out there and I play 18 holes and loving it. <laughs> Just loving it. Nancy moved to the villages in 2013 after retiring from Buffalo. She was attracted by Florida's warm climate and the opportunity to work on her golf game year round. But not too long after she settled in, Nancy began feeling the effects of a chronic eye condition she suffered from back in New York, dry eye. She suddenly found herself dealing with constant irritation in both eyes, redness, and even swelling. It was very difficult for me to uh, do 18 holes. Not that I didn't do them, I did them. But the constant drops, the constant maintenance of the eye really became unbearable. As the condition worsened, the constant irritation from having dry eyes had an impact on her golf game. As she lost her ability to focus on the ball after it was hit, the condition got so bad, it even started affecting her at work. Working the computer was getting too difficult. I couldn't focus on the computer. She had very little work on the computer. I couldn't do it anymore. I just could not keep my eyes going. Hello. Hi, Dr. Pollock. By the time she contacted Ocala Eye, 10 months had passed, and Nancy had developed infection in both eyes. And I, I just can't do this anymore. So when I first saw her, she was absolutely miserable. She was using artificial tears 20, 30 times a day. Dr. Peter Pollock is a cornea specialist at Ocala Eye who's been treating dry eye conditions, like Nancy's, for almost 20 years. In 2011, he founded the first dry eye center in the region. After evaluating her condition, he informed Nancy that her problem was not, in fact, dry eye. So you don't have that reservoir of fluid. But rather a common condition that's often confused for dry eye because the symptoms are so similar. We determined that at least part of her problem is a condition called CCH, or conjunctival cholesis. And this is a loosening of the tissue known as the conjunctiva. CCH is a condition that generally affects patients over the age of 50 and damages the eye's ability to stay lubricated. This occurs when the surface layer, called the conjunctiva, begins to separate from the surface of the eye, eliminating the reservoir that normally holds tears. This causes the eye to become very dry and irritated. In Nancy's case, Dr. Pollock performed a simple procedure to remove the excess tissue that was forcing tears away from her eye. The procedure is painless and lasts about 20 minutes and took place at the Ocala Eye Surgery Center. The CCH condition, which is associated with chronic dry eye, is something that's uh, underdiagnosed and a significant percentage of patients that have what they perceive to be dry eye symptoms actually have this CCH condition. So they've been to numerous doctors, they've used all kinds of eye drops and medications and they've had no relief and in many cases they're told that it's just all in their imagination. For Nancy, the procedure was quick and painless. All I can say is Dr. Pollock is a ter tremendous man, he's a tremendous doctor, he knows what he's talking about. I felt nothing. He promised me that I wouldn't. I wished I would have done it and not waited so long to do it. Today, Nancy is back to her active schedule of playing golf three times a week, and she's no longer held back from working on the computer at her job. Her quality of life has drastically improved since receiving the CCH treatment at Ocala Eye. It's much easier to play golf. It's um, uh, much easier to to live my life, to, uh, you know, to go out. Uh, what movie do you want to see? I'm living a pretty normal life, pretty normal, considering where I was. I think I go 18 holes. No so, problem. No problem. So uh, in her case, as in the case of a lot of these patients, it's, it's life-changing.